Hey guys, it's Coke from Math Challenge. If you're new to my channel, you can always get the printouts 100% free from my website at www.bridgemath.com. The link is down below and you can try the problems before watching my solutions. So on today's particular problem, I think the trickiest part is imagining what the inside of the cube looks like and how that affects the outer shape. So let's take a look. Let's get our pencils out, thinking cap on, seatbelts fastened. Let's go for that math ride. Woo! Alrighty guys, were you guys able to visualize the inside of the cube? So if we cut out the three centimeters squares and carve it all the way through the cube, it's made up of three centimeter cubes around. And if we count them up, it looks like there's three on the middle vertical section right here, and there's four surrounding it. So there's a total of seven small cubes. So if you find the volume of the inner cubes, we can write that as three times three times three. And since there's seven, we'll multiply it by seven. And that should give us a total of 189 cubic centimeters. And once we find the volume of the inside, we can think about finding the volume of whatever is left over by subtracting the outer volume from the inner volume. So the outer volume can be found by taking the 9 and multiplying it 3 times with the volume formula. And that should give us a total of 729 cubic centimeters. So the total volume is taking the 729 and subtracting the inner volume of 189 and that should give us a total of 540 cubic centimeters. As always, if you enjoyed this video, if you can just smash that subscribe button, I greatly appreciate it. I upload two new challenge problems a week, so you can stay tuned for that. Stick around, I will be sharing the next challenge that's coming up along with the joke of the day. I'll see you guys next time on Math Challenge. Thank you so much. Bye-bye.